Breaking news, breaking news. Jaguar Wright has been arrested about three hours ago. The girl is in the lockup. Apparently, she had some drugs on her. And I guess they must have been waiting for her to act a fool. But they didn't give her a chance. They grabbed her, I guess, searched her, found the drugs, and put her in the clink clink, the lockup. But guys, you know, this is not like her going to a mental institution. This time around, it's not for anything mental, it's for drug possession. And you know with that, with all the other antics that she's been going on with and prior arrests, it might not go so good for your girl. She may have to serve some time, depending on what type of drugs and how much ounces they found on her. But let me tell you, when you dig a hole for someone, you got to dig one for yourself because I just put a video out where I was talking about the same thing, that she wants to do her husband in, and at all costs, she's painting the picture of so much negativity, and she's flying Solar in to testify against him, and she's going to go out there to Arizona and uh, get him extradited and file charges and put him in jail, and look who got arrested first, because there's something called karma in the universe, all right? Call it God. All right, call it what you want to call it. But what you put out there, boomerang comes back to you. You want to do evil on someone else, that evil comes back to you. So she's not going to be explaining this away, how she pulled the wool over the eye of all those psychiatrists. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, uh, this is no explaining, honey. She doing some time. I wonder how long she's going to be in there. And I wonder if Miss Lejean is going to go bail her out. Because, you know, she's quick to run and bail Jaguar out. So I can see her now doing her little fundraising and asking for cash app money. But I don't know if people are going to send it this time. Because we've seen Jaguar's antics. We've seen it. And we know jail is not for her. She should be back in the mental hospital. Well, Goomba said that Legina wanted to be the woman of the house and wanted to take Jaguar's place. So <laughs> here's her chance, honey, to step into that role, to step into that footsteps, those shoes of Jaguar. Because Jaguar even said, even if she wanted to get rid of Legina, she couldn't because her mother loves her. Her mother loved having her around. Now, listen, with Jaguar out of the picture, Legina is going to take over. Now, Legina was supposed to get an apartment. That's what Jaguar announced two days ago. I don't think she's going to get that apartment anymore because Jaguar is out of the picture. And I think Legina's biggest obstacle in terms of happiness was Jaguar because she was siphoning money out of her. So now that she's gone, I think Legina, Sam, and the mother can live their best life. And I think they're going to be happy now that she's out of the picture because she's a mental basket case. Let's face it. But it doesn't make any sense at all to see how this woman have completely destroyed her life. Nobody has destroyed her life. She did it on her own. Because God gave her a gift of singing. And anytime God blesses you that way, you're supposed to use it for good. You're supposed to be maybe singing in a choir somewhere. Maybe putting out some really, really good songs that, can, that could stand the test of time. So after you're dead and gone, the songs live on. That's what you're supposed to do when you got a gift, when God gives you a gift. But to use it the way she's using it, I'm telling you, it's, it's, a, it's a crying shame. And I'm going to tell you something. For the past year, Jaguar has been doing stuff to end up in jail. She really has. When you walk into a police station with a knife in your pocket and you're threatening um, officer, what's his name? Ramirez, the Spanish officer, and all the stuff she's been doing, she wanted to go to jail subconsciously, not consciously. And she wanted Goomba to go first, though. I think she's got a death wish because the other night she's been, she was sitting in front of the police station. She had on the same clothes as the day before. So she must have slept out there at the police station. She said she was going to go in and file some type of report, but she never mentioned it the day after, so I don't think she went in. But maybe she went in tonight into, uh, well, this afternoon into the mayor's office 
or wherever she went. Somebody said she went into the mayor's office, but it could have been the police department because she likes to harass the cops. So I'm thinking the police department. Someone said the mayor's office, though. But whatever public official building she went into, they found drugs on her. Now, you want to tell me that this woman didn't want to be arrested and she got drugs on her going into a place where cops are? Come on. Because even if it's the mayor's office, there are cops there guarding the building. So it didn't matter. You know, I'm thinking she went wherever she went, whatever building she went into, she acted a fool. Because there's no way they're going to just arrest you if you go into the police department to make out a report. They will take a statement, you fill out a report, and you're done. If you go to the mayor's office and you want to put in a complaint, the secretary stops you right there or the assistant to the mayor and they say, okay, we're going to pass it on to the mayor. You're done. You leave. But I think she acted a fool. She's got real mental issues, real deep-seated mental issues that really needs to be addressed. It cannot be addressed with her going into a mental facility for three to nine days and being released. She needs a long-term stay. She needs to be somewhere to protect her from herself. And no, I don't think jail is for her because she really got mental issues. Anyway, YouTubers, I just wanted to give you guys that update. It's a, it's a very, very short video because much is not known. So if you guys know which building she was in when she got arrested, drop it in the comment section. I'm not sure if it was the mayor's building or the police department. Anyway, YouTubers, I'm over now. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel and to this video. I guess in the morning, we're going to hear more details from Legina. Well, that's the only person we can hear details from because Jaguar is locked up. And Legina got to go down there now and do what she did do with the bond. I don't even know if they got enough money for bond because Goomba is out of the picture. So Legina is our only source of um, someone helping her. I'm over now. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel and to this video. Thank you for watching.